Oh hey there guys, uh, Falmir here and uh, I'm just bringing you a quick tutorial on how to install a Minecraft custom or challenge map, just how to install a map you downloaded off the internet for Minecraft. Um, so first off, this is my channel up here. Why don't you go, um, if you enjoy these videos I, I'd appreciate a like or a comment or a sub or anything. Um, so uh, alright, let's get into it here. Um, so basically to install a map I'm just gonna use the skyblock map here um, you can use it, it this it works the same for every map installing a minecraft map is um, a very easy easy task it's not difficult one thing I recommend doing though before you install any challenge map is make sure you check if the version of the map um, is uh, what what um, version of minecraft the map is written for for example, Skyblock here, 1.1 slash uh, 1.0, or vice versa, 2.0, <laughs> 2.0. Anyway, <clears throat> um, and the reason I recommend that is uh, simply because um, Minecraft scene, they always add new features whenever they um, send out a new version of Minecraft. And um, so it can be sometimes the maps will not quite work properly when a new version comes out. Um, so we're, anyway, we're gonna first step to doing to installing a challenge map is to obviously download the map. So we are going to um, download the map here. Um, so whatever map you're installing, if you're installing Skyblock, then follow exactly along, I guess. Uh, if you're installing uh, whatever challenge map you're installing or whatever map you're installing, just download it. And um, so to do this next part, after you have the map downloaded, you're going to need um, a compression software, meaning like. Uh, like uh, either here's a here's a good one here seven zip I'll put this link in the description I don't use seven zip I am currently using jzip uh, but there's a bunch of them there's seven zip um, I think there's um, winrar winrar yeah and then there's also one I'm using which is jzip and they all it, it, to me like I found it it doesn't really matter which one you use they're all pretty similar um, they do the same basic sort of idea. You can use any one you want, um, but you're going to need one, so pick one. <laughs> so, Alright, so once you got the file downloaded, you have to go to wherever um, you have it stored. I have it here, and apparently I had it downloaded once already. Doesn't matter. Um, so basically, go to where you have it downloaded and use your software. I have JZip, I have JZip, and you're going to want to extract the files that you have that are there because they're compressed. Um, for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm just going to extract them to my desktop. Okay, so let's close that out. Um, so here we go. This was also in the file, this Mac uh, thing here. I believe this is just the Mac version of the world. Um, so we're just going to do that because this is a Windows tutorial, obviously. Um, so now now that you have the, the map here downloaded and you have it found, um, and you have it uncompressed, you have it all ready to go, you just got to put it in Minecraft. So to do that, you have to find the Minecraft um, Minecraft file, where the, all your Minecraft files are stored. And if you don't know how to find it, there's a really easy way to do that. So basically, uh, you just want to go into your little search bar here, and you want to hit Run, on your little Run bar, and then you want to type in percent, percent, app, data, percent, and then you want to either hit enter or OK, doesn't matter. Uh, go to the my, dot .minecraft, and this is the Minecraft folder, if you uh, can't even, if that doesn't work for you, here's the little uh, uh, address for it, just type this in, uh, c slash users slash your users, like I'm John, slash whatever your name is. Uh, slash app data slash roaming slash dot minecraft then you want to go into the saves folder uh, I already have one here One sec. Shh, no okay so say you do not have your map in here like I already did apparently um, all you're gonna do to install your map is either drag your map in drop it which works just fine there's absolutely nothing wrong with that but <clears throat> I'm also gonna give you another quick tip here you can either right click and click copy and then right click and then click paste which will just create a copy of this and then drop the copy in here um, and the reason I this is how I do it I usually just hit control C highlight whatever I'm copying control C control V into the folder um, 
The reason I do this is because if you mess up while playing your map, or Skyblock especially is a bad one for that, if you mess up while uh, playing your map, and you want to start over, or you just like your map and you want to do it again, then all you have to do is go back to the original file, copy, paste another one in, delete your old file, right? Uh, rather than, you know, going back and, you know, Googling and then Googling and then finding Skyblock and then downloading it all over again, right? Or whatever your map is, uh, then all you have to do is just put another one in. Um, so let's just quickly run Minecraft here. It's gonna look crap because my desktop resolution is, my screen resolution is horrible. It's ridiculous. Okay, um, so let's just quickly go in here. And here is the Skyblock map. I'm just gonna quickly load it so you can see what it looks like. Camtasia records the game. I don't know. Yep, there's Skyblock, your tree, your land. Um, so there you go. There's a quick tutorial for you on this, how to install a custom map. Uh, I just use Skyblock. Oh, I just screwed myself. Um, you can use whatever map you want. It, it's exactly the same for every uh, map out there. It's not difficult. You just basically you download it, uncompress it, throw it in the right folder, and you're good to go. On the play. Um, the reason I use Skyblock is because me and my buddy uh, Chachi over at Black and White Entertainment are going to be doing a... Um, no. because we're actually going to be doing the Skyblock map. We've actually recorded quite a few, uh, a couple episodes already, and we're going to start uploading them right away. Um, I need that sapling. Um, so, um, he's um, got, a, like I said, we've got a couple episodes already done, and I believe he's going to upload every Monday, was what he said he wanted to do. Episode Minecraft Monday kind of thing. This might look like crap, this recording of mine, simply because... I'm recording with Camtasia and my desktop resolution is really screwed up and it's really weird. Um, but I promise you the Skyblock, our Skyblock videos will be high definition with amazing audio and whatnot. Um, so make sure you go check out that and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, it was just a quick one, wasn't meant to confuse anybody. Uh, if you have any questions just let me know in the comments and uh, I will do my very best to answer and help out in any way possible. Alright, thanks guys. Um, have a good one.